From abandoned man-made mines to natural sinkholes and underwater pits, we reveal the deepest, most dangerous holes on the planet that will make you think twice before taking that stroll, as they have swallowed machines, animals, and people. Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Forever Green. In this video, we explore the 10 most dangerous holes on planet Earth, and you should stick around for number one as some of these Earth's deepest places have stories as dark as their depths. Number 10. Blue Hole, Red Sea Also known as the Diver Cemetery, the Blue Hole is located in Dahab, Egypt, with a depth of 328 feet. While diving in the Blue Hole might not be dangerous itself, this underwater sinkhole has a unique feature which makes it incredibly lethal. At around 181 feet down, there's a rock tunnel known as the Arch that connects the hole with the Red Sea. Because the water is so clear, light at the end of the tunnel makes the arch look a lot shorter than it really is, when in reality, the tunnel is 85 feet long. This length, together with a current that constantly flows into the blue hole from the Red Sea, slows the progress down. These factors make it so deadly for even the most experienced divers who attempt it thinking it will be easy, unknown to them, for its deceptive length and current. The blue hole is associated with a death toll of between 130 to 200. A famous death here was 22-year-old Yuri Lipskys, who took a video camera with him descending uncontrollably to the bottom. Yuri, as seen in the footage, panics and tries to fill a buoyancy compensator. But he's too deep, and the pressure stops him from rising off the bottom. His remains were collected the next day by deep water diving specialist, Tarek Omar. Number 9. Door to Hell, Gates of Hell The Door to Hell in Darwiz, Turkmenistan, is a Soviet experiment that turned out to be bare unintended consequences. In 1971, scientists initially wanted to use the remote desert site to drill for natural gas. The ground beneath, however, collapsed as the drilling rig hit a natural cavern filled with gas and they had to stop the drilling. The hole is approximately 230 feet wide and 65.5 feet deep. Fearing the spread of poisonous gases into the surrounding towns, geologists intentionally lit the natural methane gas by tossing a grenade into the hole, anticipating that it'd burn off within a week. That was more than four decades ago, and it has, however, been burning continuously ever since. Its glowing is visible from Derwiz each night. Fittingly, the name Derwiz means gate in the Turkmen language, so locals have dubbed the burning hole the Gate to Hell, and is actively being encouraged as a tourist attraction site by the Turkmen government. At night, camel spiders attracted to its light and warmth fall to their deaths in this pit's fiery bowels. And if you think this place is not dangerous, the number one will have you ossified. Number eight, the Kola Super Deep Borehole. The project to drill into the Earth's surface began near Murmansk in Perchensky District, Russia, in the 1970s, when Soviet scientists wanted to learn more about the Earth's crust. Over two decades, they managed to dig more than 39,600 feet, seven and a half miles, into the Earth so deep that if Mount Everest was placed into the hole, its peak would still be underwater by more than 10,560 feet, two miles. The Kola borehole is also further down than the wreck of the Titanic, which is 12,500 feet down into the ocean. However, in 1992, they had to stop drilling because the temperature was around 180 degrees Celsius, which was far much hotter than the scientists had projected it would be. All this drilling wasn't for nothing though, as some scientific discoveries were made. The researchers found out that there is water at 12 kilometers into the Earth's crust. Additionally, they found 24 new types of long-dead single-celled organisms and gained access to rocks that were 2.7 billion years old. Hidden underneath this rusty lid is the Kola Super Deep Borehole. If you fell down the hole, it would take around 4 minutes to reach the bottom. Locals in the area say that the hole is so deep, you can hear the screams of people being tortured in hell. Hence its nickname, the Well to Hell. Before we move on to our next most dangerous hole, leave us a like, smash that subscribe button, and turn on notifications and you'll win 10 years of incredible luck. Number 7. The Devil's Sinkhole The Devil's Sinkhole in Texas, USA, commonly known as the Satanic Sinkhole, is a huge vertical cavern that reaches 400 feet down from a 50-foot opening, carved from water erosion over thousands of years. The Devil's Sinkhole's precise history is still unknown to scientists. However, artifacts found inside the cave 
date from 400 to 2500 BC. Among the artifacts are arrowheads and burnt rocks suggesting that the hole might have been used as a Native American burial site. Three people are known to have died by falling into the sinkhole in modern times, with the most recent in 1972, which led to the area being transferred to the state of Texas in 1985 and opened to the public in 1992. Today, access to the area is only available through advanced reservations. Do you suffer from coroptophobia? Then this is definitely not the tourist destination point for you, as the sinkhole is home to more than 3 million Mexican free-tailed bats that, terrifyingly, emerge screeching from the depths at sunset during April through October. Number 6. Dean's Blue Hole Dean's Blue Hole, popularly known as the Deadly Diving Hotspot, located in Long Island, Bahamas, is one of the deepest underwater sinkholes on Earth at 663 feet deep, taking its name from a local Bahamian family. At the surface, the Dean's Blue Hole has a diameter of 115 feet, but after descending 66 feet under, the hole winds considerably into a cavern with a diameter of 330 feet. Formed over 15,000 years ago, Dean's Blue Hole is thought to be the result of a sinkhole formed by rainwater soaking through cracks in limestone bedrock when sea levels were lower. The hole is visible above water because of the deep blue hue of its water, compared to the light blue around it. It's home to all sorts of marine life, including tropical fish, turtles, and seahorses. Since April 2008, it has been the site of the Vertical Blue Free Diving Competition. Legend says that the hole was dug by the devil himself and that he's still there, dragging those that dare to swim there to their deaths. In 2013, Nicholas Mivoli died shortly after surfacing from diving into Dean's Blue Hole from a pulmonary edema, excess fluid in the lungs, the first death in an international free diving competition. In 2008, three women drowned when one fell into the hole and the other two were trying to save her. The youngest victim was just 14. Cops arrived at the scene to find the three women's bodies floating by the shoreline after the horrific accident. Number 5. Kimberley Mine The Kimberley Diamond Mine in South Africa, also known as the Big Hole, is claimed to be the deepest hand-dug hole anywhere in the world. At over 700 feet, the Big Hole was excavated by 50,000 diamond miners with shovels and pickaxes between 1871 and 1914. It is so large that it is visible from space. However, the operation didn't come without tragedy as between 1897 and 1899, 7,853 patients were admitted to Kimberley Hospital following accidents on site. At least 1,114 died, mostly from tuberculosis and other sicknesses caused by the horrendous conditions the miners lived and worked in. Legend has it that if you listen carefully while standing at the opening, you could still hear the cries of the miners long gone. After mining stopped, the hole became the most visited tourist attraction in the area, and today, it has a museum just next door. Number 4. Berkeley Pit The Berkeley Pit in Montana, USA, is a 1,780-foot deep abandoned copper mine, and now one of the only places in the world where you can pay to see toxic waste. It was closed in 1982 and has slowly been filling with water ever since. And because the rocks in the mine contain heavy metals and chemicals like sulfuric acid, the site now holds back more than 6.5 trillion gallons of toxic acidic copper colored water. In 2016, a large flock of several thousand snow geese landed in the pool pit to avoid a snowstorm. Worried officials tried to scare the birds out of the water and stop more landing, but eventually around 4,000 of the geese were killed by being exposed to chemicals in the water. Would you visit this toxic copper colored lake? Leave a like and let me know in the comments below. Number 3. Glory Hole The Glory Hole is a spillway of the Monticello Dam, USA. The Monticello Dam was completed in 1957. Its function is to keep people safe by making sure water levels in Lake Berryessa don't overwhelm the dam and cause floods. Rather than spilling over the edge of the dam when the water grows higher, it is funneled into a spillway. The Glory Hole, which is 72 feet wide and 700 feet deep, it can hold a maximum of 362,000 gallons of water per second, and water only spills out into the Glory Hole when it reaches 15.5 feet above the level of the funnel. And the last time this happened was in May 2006. For Emily Schwalek, the 72 feet wide drain was a deadly trap as the 41-year-old was swimming in the lake in 1997 when she found herself being pulled towards the spillway 
after she had crossed the buoy line designed to keep bathers out of harm's way. Number 2. Shand Bori Built between 800 and 900 AD, Shand Bori in Abaneri, India, is one of the biggest step wells in the world, with a depth of 100 feet. It was made to keep rainwater from the monsoon season for use at drier times of the year. Three sides of the well have 3,500 steps that drop 100 feet down, while the fourth side houses a temple to the Hindu god, Harshat Mata, the goddess of happiness. Because of deadly accidents in the past, one now needs special permission to go down into the bottom of the monster well. Local legend even claims that the well was dug in a single night by ghosts, but film buffs will better recognize it as Batman's prison in the setting of Dark Knight Rises, as well as the scene for setting of the fall. It's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber wondering about this gigantic monstrous shark that appears to be emerging from an underwater sinkhole. If you come across a mysterious photo online and want us to look into it, just send it over and we may even feature it on a future video. Now, we looked into this picture and are excited to reveal to you that it is indeed the most dangerous shark in the world, the bull shark. Bull sharks are responsible for more documented attacks on people than any other species of shark. The famous blockbuster movie Jaws was actually inspired by a true story where several people were killed by one or more bull sharks. So be on the lookout when swimming out in the ocean. Nonetheless, there is a sinkhole that comes very close to looking like the one in this picture, and that's number one, Great Blue Hole. 60 miles off the coast of Belize is the Great Blue Hole, one of the largest sea holes in the world. Also known as the Deep Blue Grave, the gigantic pit is almost 1,000 feet wide and over 400 feet deep, and is home to reef and bull sharks like the one on the just explained subscriber picks photo. Originally, the Blue Hole was a limestone cave that started to form about 150,000 years ago. Gradually, the water level rose and the caves were flooded and its roof collapsed, forming this unique hole. The hole, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is a popular scuba diving spot made famous by Jacques Cousteau in the 1970s, who named it one of the best dive spots on the planet. Last year, virgin billionaire Richard Branson went with Cousteau's grandson, Fabian, to the bottom of the chasm in a submarine. At the bottom, they found the bodies of two of the three divers who were thought to have gone missing in the hole. 